Hey, Melissa Dinwiddie here from Creative Sandbox Solutions. Let's talk innovation. It's not just a buzzword. It is the lifeblood of any organization that wants to stay relevant and crush it in today's wild business landscape. But here's the kicker. There are two seemingly opposing mindset roadblocks that I see tripping up companies left and right. And guess what? We are all guilty of falling into these traps. The first one I like to call the big fat lie of not creative. So those super smart tech whizzes on your team who are the ones who are tasked with innovating on demand, odds are that they don't actually think of themselves as creative. And let me ask you, would you call yourself an artist? Most people wouldn't, right? But newsflash, all of those labels, creative, artist, they actually have nothing to do with what's true, which is that just by virtue of being human, you are creative. And all of this self-limiting nonsense that we do to ourselves, it's like kryptonite to innovation. It is the ultimate creativity killer that's making us too scared to even dip our toes into the innovation pool. So that is the first block. The second one is what I like to call too much of a good thing. On the flip side, we've got this know-it-all syndrome. You know, when you're, you're so darn good at what you do that you can't see past your own expertise. It's like we're wearing blinders made of gold stars and certificates. And that can make us unwilling to try anything new because we know the right way to do it, right? Oh my God, that's what Blockbuster thought, right? And look what happened to them. That's what Vanilla Ice still thinks. And not only is he on a I Love the 90s tour, he wants to convince everyone to go back to the 90s. Crazy. We don't want that to happen to us. So while being an expert is, is great, it's awesome, it can also make us blind to new opportunities that are staring us right in the face. And here's the real mind vendor. We can totally be suffering from both of these at the same time. Talk about a creativity pretzel, right? So what do you do about these mindset roadblocks? Well, this is where my create the impossible framework comes in to whoo, save the day. So let's break it down. There are three steps, three parts. The first part, play hard. And no, I do not mean to go to Vegas and get drunk. Although, you know, you can do that if you want. But what I'm talking about here is to embrace your inner four-year-old. Because innovation thrives when we're having fun, when we're taking risks and, you know, playing like, like in a, a sandbox. You got to be in that beginner mind space of what would happen if, right? So let's create spaces where people can brainstorm without judgment, where we can bounce the craziest ideas around the room like little kids playing in a sandbox. You notice that the name of my book is The Creative Sandbox Way. Okay, so that's step one. Step two, make crap. And yes, you heard me right. We need to get comfortable with making a mess because I'm sure you've heard the, the saying before, perfect is the enemy of done. And we need the crap to fertilize the good stuff. So encourage your teams to just crank out ideas, crank out prototypes and, and crank out solutions like there is no tomorrow because quantity breeds quality. So let's get those creative juices flowing. Step three, learn fast. And here's where the magic happens because every failure, quote unquote, is just a stepping stone to success. So we need to create a culture where people aren't afraid to fall on their faces because they know they'll get up smarter and stronger. By embracing this framework, play hard, 
make crap, learn fast, we can tackle both ends of our innovation paradox. We boost our creative confidence by playing and making without fear while staying humble and open to new ideas through rapid learning and iteration. Remember, innovation is not about being the smartest person in the room. It is about being curious and persistent and willing to look at things from a fresh perspective. So let's ditch the not enough lie, shake off the expert blinders and dive headfirst into creating the impossible. My superpower is empowering the most <laughs> empowering your most analytical minds with the mindset, skill set, and toolkit to achieve breakthrough innovation with my three-step create the impossible process. So when you're ready to revolutionize your innovation game, let's chat about how I can help. You can book your complimentary impact assessment call at bit.ly slash md45. That's bit.ly slash md45. 45. See you next time.